Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be unboxing the Glossy Box for July 2019. Glossy Box is a monthly makeup and skincare subscription. It retails for $21 a month and it has some full size, some sample size items depending on the month, usually about five or six items in the box. I do have a link where you can get 20% off any length subscription. If you sign up for longer subscriptions, it is cheaper. So I will leave that link for 20% off down below. If you're new to my channel, I do lots of different unboxings here from beauty, home decor, fashion, bath, and everything in between. So if you love subscription boxes, go ahead and subscribe. And let's go ahead and get in the glossy box for this month. These boxes are really, really nice quality. They're great to save to store things in. That's what it looks like on the inside. And they're always very nicely packaged. So it has the pamphlet for the month and some ribbon. So let's undo that. So on top is the pamphlet. Um, and so it tells you a little bit about the month and then on the inside it'll show all the products and there is just some nice little tissue paper here and when you take off the sticker all of the goodies are inside so let's go ahead and get in I haven't been super excited about glossy box recently but we'll see so here it lists everything that I am getting so the first thing that I am pulling out is um, Leighton Denny's Miracle Mist speed drying spray for nail polish interesting that's something different okay so this is the full size is 75 milliliters and that this is full size and it retails for $14 so that's what it looks like there um, got the perfect polish but not the time this little number is your secret weapon for an effortless manicure in a pinch don't worry this mist is non sticky and will dry your nails in seconds say goodbye to long wait times and hello to freshly manicured hand selfies now I don't paint my fingernails, but I do paint my toenails, so this will be great when I like put on my toenail polish and then realize I need to go do something. Um, so I didn't even know that this type of a product existed, and I'm excited to discover it. Um, okay, good start. The next product I'm pulling out is from Oriza Beauty. I think that's how you say it. That's it there. Um, this is a lipstick Lido. Is that the shade? Yes. And retails for this is a full size and is $22.50. So it's a cruelty-free lipstick. It's a velvet ribbon collection. It has a long-lasting color and satin finish. It has a glide-on formula. Blah blah blah. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, the tip is a little bit smushed. I'm not sure if you can see that. Wow, I really don't know how to show this. Um, but let's see. It's still it's still like usable though. So let's swatch. Ooh. Okay, it smells like lipstick. It doesn't have like a great scent. Let's swatch it on my hand. Okay, with the beauty light, I can't tell if it's like super pink or if it's just me, but that is what that looks like. I think that that's pretty. I, 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 think, I'll, I think I would like that. I don't know if it's going to be too pink for me, but I definitely am okay with that. I am not mad about that for sure. You never have too many lipsticks. It's kind of like a peach, a pink, a pinky pink, peachy pink. It's not peachy. I don't know, it's like a coral pink is how I would describe that. It's pretty for summer for sure. All right, next thing that I'm pulling out is from Luscious Cosmetics, and this is their camera powder. Um, this is one compact as featured, and it retails for $29. So, so far, three full-size items, and it is sealed. So let me grab some scissors back here to open it up. Um, so it says lights, camera set, unlike it's competition this is extra finely milled and colorless the perfect skin tones it's perfect for all skin tones and super effective um so i guess that this w is great for camera which is great for me because i film um but it can be good if you're like taking a picture of yourself or a selfie and it really okay <laughs> really doesn't want me to pull the product out of the package all right so this is full size it it, it is pretty like i don't know doesn't seem huge doesn't seem like there's a lot of product in there um, so I don't know if I would pay $29 for that, but that's what the powder looks like. It is just a basic white powder. I'm not going to swatch it yet because I do want to use it, but I don't want to get my fingers in it right now. It's just a white powder. So I'll have to try that. It really is not, doesn't seem like a whole lot of product, uh, 0.19 ounces, 5.5 grams, but who knows? So that just seems like for $29. I mean, I'm glad to have it and I will definitely use it. I like the product itself, but 
not sure if I'll repurchase. All right, next thing is from After Spa, and this is their amazing makeup remover. Whoops, another full size product, and it retails for $5. So, this is one of these like makeup eraser type of things. I. I'm not gonna open this because I don't think I'm gonna use it. I might put it in a future giveaway. I think this stuff is gimmicky. I don't know, that's what it looks like. I might just use it as like a washcloth for my face. That's probably what I'll do. I'll probably use it as a washcloth for my face, but not as a makeup remover. Um, I just, this is just unrealistic for me because I wear makeup every day. And when I do film, I have worn makeup to work. I take it off, wait an hour or two, and then I put another like set, like redo my face. <laughs> so I, I take my makeup off a lot and I just don't have time to wash these all the time, but I'll use it as like a, a washcloth for my face instead. That works too. All right. The last product is um, from Jerlique and this is their Rosewater Balancing Mist. That's what the box looks like there. It says the full size is 15 milliliters and this is 15 milliliters and it says that this retails for $69. So wait, everything here is full sized. Okay. Um, that's full size. I mean, I don't, Derlique is probably a really nice brand. So um, this is a number one glo um, global bestseller. This mist will bring your inner glow to the surface as it hydrates, shields, and balances your skin's pH levels. Um, Plus the fragrance will leave you feeling rosy and that is a perfect way to freshen up in between and after makeup. I've gotten so many sprays this summer and I like a setting spray, but just a spray spray, not really my jam, don't need it because it just doesn't do anything for my skin. And there's been a lot of rose sprays. Now this one's a very cute little bottle. I just, $69 for this. Like who pays $69 for 15, like, I'm sorry, there's way, that's, you have to be filthy rich to spend $70 on this. Um, but I'm, I'm, I will use it. I'm not going to complain. Well, I'm just complaining, but I'm not going to complain. Like, I will use it. I just don't realistically see why somebody would spend $70 on this unless it literally made their skin look <clears throat> flawless. So let's kind of see what the mist is going to look like here. Okay. It smells like rose. And the mist is nice. You do have to hold it a little bit further out. I mean, it's a mist. It's a rose mist. It smells like rose. It, this one, so there's different types of like rose smells. This one, I'm going to be honest, has a little bit more of like the grandma old lady type of rose smell rather than like a fresh rose smell, if you know what I mean. Um, but it's cute. It'll be cute to sit on a little vanity, but like $70, come on. Would you spend $70 on this? I'm curious. I'm just curious. Like, is it just me? Am I just, I don't know. But anyway, that is everything that we got in the glossy box for this month for boxes where I get like five items I rate the box so I give it a point if I like it I'm gonna use it I give it no points if I don't like it I'm not gonna use it it's not for me and then a half a point if mm, I might use it I'm not really sure not sure if it's gonna be part of my routine so let's go through and rate the box so the spray I'm gonna give a half a point because like I just I don't need another spray but like I'll use it because it's bougie and it's cute so I'll give that a half a point the powder I will use. I'm curious. I'm gonna have to try this the next time I film. So I'll give this a point. So we're at a point and a half. The lipstick. I think that this shade will work for me. So I'm gonna say that it's a point um, until I tr actually try it on my lips and then we'll see if I it'll still be a point or not, but that's two and a half points. Um, this makeup towel thing, not for me. Like I said, I'm gonna use it as a washcloth, but I just think these are gimmicky. So I'm not gonna give it any points for that. So still two and a half points. And then this mist, I'm so intrigued and excited to try something like this because I've never heard of it. So I'm definitely going to give it a point unless it like totally doesn't work. So that makes this glossy box three and a half points. Um, I like this glossy box a lot better than the ones we've gotten <clears throat> the past month or so. So I'm, I'm okay. Everything was full size, I guess. Um, but I'm curious to hear your thoughts on the box. So let me know down in the comments below. Again, you can get 20% off of your first box using the code or link or whatever I have down below. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and I will see you in my next video.